Hi, and thank you for joining us. In this brief video, I'll give you step-by-step -step instructions on how to create your free 30-day trial of WebRoot Secure Anywhere Business Endpoint Protection, and how to get started with your online admin account. To begin, visit webroot.com and hover over Business, and then click on Free Trials. Here you will see an array of WebRoot product trials available, but in this case, you'll want to click on the Free Trial button next to WebRoot Secure Anywhere Business Endpoint Protection. A web form will appear asking for basic account info. Please be sure to fill out the entire form with accurate contact information and then click Get My Free Trial. A confirmation page will appear letting you know that an email has been sent to the address you provided. You should receive an email from WebRoot Security within a few minutes that has a link to access your account for the first time. The email will also include your account key code and other valuable links to resources such as product guides and WebRoot support. After clicking the link to create your account, you will be directed to the account creation page. You will notice that the product key code and email address that you signed up with have been pre-populated. Here you will set your account password. Please be sure that it is alphanumeric, at least nine characters long, and includes both upper and lowercase letters. It is important to note that the personal security code is not the same as your product key code. This is an additional layer of security that WebRoot provides. Please be sure to choose something that is easy for you to remember because you will need it every time you log in. Then choose a security question in case you ever forget your passcode. After completing the page, click register now. Now you're ready to log in. Enter the password you just created and then you will need to enter two characters from your security code. Every time you log in, WebRoot will ask for two randomly chosen characters from your security code in order to authenticate that it is truly you accessing the admin console. After logging in, you should see the main home page. From here, click on Endpoint Protection. When logging in for the first time, you will see the Setup Wizard. This is where you can choose the default policy that will be initially applied to all new endpoints that are added to your account. Recommended defaults is the policy that has been tuned by WebRoot to be optimal for an enterprise environment. Silent Audit is a report-only policy that will send reporting data, threats, undetermined software, and more to the admin console, but will not take any action against those threats. The Unmanaged setting allows for the local user to manage their own client. For this video, we will choose the recommended defaults. From here, you will go to the console homepage, which has download instructions for deploying WebRoot Secure Anywhere across your endpoints. We have two installation packages. The most common installation package is the MSI installer. This is the best choice for anyone who has Active Directory. For more information on deploying using group policy, please watch our video specific to that feature on our YouTube page. From here, you are ready to begin using WebRoot Secure Anywhere business endpoint protection. If you have any additional questions, feel free to contact your nearest WebRoot representative. Thank you again for watching.